Hello everybody, welcome back to this sweet collector booster box opening. We got Streets of New Capenna. Uh, I try to do this just about every set. I think there's like one or two that I skipped. Um, just because I wasn't really into the set and didn't want all the extras. So, um, Crimson Vow. Crimson Vow, I think I skipped Crimson Vow. Uh, I might have skipped Innistrad too, I don't remember. I didn't do the double feature thingy, whatever that was either. So, But we're going to go ahead and see. I really like the box. It's very, very colorful. Um, so, okay, we we'll get into this. We got, uh, was it 12 packs, right? I think, yeah, I think it's 12 packs. I only put 11 in your box. Okay, thanks. Appreciate it. So, get this out of the way. You get this uh, foil box topper of the alternate art Gallagreeters. Uh, you get regular in the set boosters as a box topper. So, this is how you, how you get your foil alternate art here. Rick's over here just kind of chilling. Matt's like, I'm not going to be any part of this. That's true. I was like, I'm going to clean up. And commentate in the background. And then we're already done cleaning up, so. Yeah. The only thing left is a stream PC. Oh, these suck. Uh, really a stream these PC boosters anymore. are very difficult to open. I see that. I don't know what's what either. Uh, Alright, so we got a ledger shredder. Uh, I don't know, currency converter. It's the... The commander card or something. Structural assault. Giada. Ooh. Foil. Uh, Fuller extender or whatever yeah. it is. Topiary stopper. I'm not a huge fan of that artwork though. Um, I think I'm just gonna stick with the regulars that I'll I got. I'll take it, I guess. It's a foil. You don't want it. I mean, I'll take it though. Yeah, yeah. You just take it, right? I don't know that there's any. Is there any commons or uncommons in here that are like? Standout-ish. I don't think so. Uh, so we got Rabble Rousing. Uh, Rouse Room Treasure. Uh, oh, then we have the uh, uh, Extended Art. I don't know what it is. Oh, hey, look. There's another Topiary Stopper. And Threefold Signal. It's a mythic uh, commander card. We're really shooting for, like... Planeswalkers and uh, bootlegger stash, right? That's what we really want. And don't be upset by triumphs. Oh yeah, yeah. Sorry, I need uh, I need some full arts so Matt can have them. Here's one of the uh, what did they call this? The gilded foil? I or think so. the, the raised the textured foil, the textured foil thingy yeah. that Matt brought up that's the fact that like you can actually tell a difference when feeling the card. Uh, so there's a foil with Xander. In a sleeve. In a sleeve, yeah, you can tell. Uh, flawless forgery. We've got a evolving door. Tolu's and a black market tycoon. So real quick, the gilded foils are of the uncommon are a couple bucks. Okay. So, hey, there we go. And it's a legend, too. So, like, maybe it's worth something as a... Maybe. As a commander. Commander, because everything is for commander nowadays, right? Uh, we have a Zia Torres Envoy. Uh, in Too Deep. Cut your losses. Uh, Cabaretti Ascendancy. And a foil, I don't showcase, I think that is. Giada. Why don't they put the stupid little tear thing on these ones? You want scissors? <laughs> Might be better. <laughs> uh, oh, I guess having these in foil would be pretty good for me. The fetch, like the common fetch lands and stuff. I wouldn't mind those. Uh, so there's a broker charm. All right. A foil maestro charm. Uh, so there's the Jund Trium in foil. All right. Extraction Specialist. Oh, an Evelyn, which I think somebody was looking for that here not too long ago. And a Fight Rigging. I'm really just looking to, like, fill out my play sets. I don't know how good that's going to be, but there's a lot of, I had a lot of, like, two and three O's. I don't know how everybody else, out of a case. Mm-hmm. Um, so here's a Gilded Riveteer Charm. An endless detour. Uh, cut the profits. 
scheming fence. And that is a gilded Ginny Fay. Nice. That's not bad. I know there's a bunch of people looking for uh, looking for Ginny that were around here. I don't know exactly what the card does for standard. I know it makes like tokens, but I'm assuming like commander would be a thing. Uh, there's an outlook, so that's good. Foil tramway station. So we got an evolving door. Ooh, ooh, we got a piece of candy, folks. I snuck a peek. First mythic for this pack. We got a Luxoria in the extended art. And then we've got the, what is that? Alternate art, full art, Obnixilis, the adversary? I don't even know what they call it. There's, there's three different arts. Yeah, it's like borderless something or something. I don't know. And here's this crappy Gala, foil Gala greeters. Don't even care. Literally just the big... Big one is this this Obnix list here. Uh, that, yeah, both of those are worth. Yeah, I say both of them. The Ginny's about thirteen bucks. Nice, nice. So wherever that's at, in here as the gilded foil. And I'm sure there's more. So like, leave a comment. There's, if there's something bigger and better that uh, got hit. That is not the showcase. I don't know part. what that. I don't know what it is. That would be the borderless? I think so, yeah. Let's go to Rigo. Uh, ooh, here's a Workshop Warchief in the extended art. And uh, I think this is the showcase, right, for the Lance, mm -hmm. Sparrow's headquarters, and a Jaxus. Uh, this one's like 35-ish. Okay. We got a long way to go be able to get back to the price, but uh, I mean, I don't know what retail is. Matt just takes my card and runs it. There is no MSRP. Thanks, Watsy. <laughs> uh, okay. Not bad. So there's another mythic, at least. Angel of Suffering. And then we have a uh, Horde, Hauler, Hostile Takeover. Ooh! A foil! Full art, Sparrow's headquarters. Uh, looks like about 18 bucks. Nice. So it's like 65 for the three of them. Somewhere in that ballpark. Um, so we ended up with a Nimble Larcenist, a Mass Bandits, and then an Etched Foil Max Bandits. We got a Foil Xander's Lounge. Grand Crescendo. We got a Mysterious Limousine. And incandescent Arya, and Benny Brax Zoologist. It's a commander as the commander card as the foil. It's a mythic, but I won't use any of them, so it won't actually matter. So they will get traded in to buy the stuff that I actually need. Uh, so we got a Sanguine Spy. Store reforms. Uh, another ledger shredder. Ooh, that's a piece of candy. That's the uh, Titan of Industry and a gilded foil Maestro's Ascendancy. I only had one of those part of this, so that gives me a second one, which is makes me really happy. That foil um, Benny is almost twenty bucks. Which one? That second one. No. This one. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Thank you, Commander players. Normal one's 12 bucks. And we get last pack. Got a foil cap ready charm. My foil charms are okay. We got a wire tapping. Uh, Jolene. An Avon heart stabber. Maestro's ascendancy. And a foil obscura ascendancy. So I think, for the most part, that's probably it. I mean, the lands are going to be worth something. Well, the lands are probably 15 bucks a piece. Yeah. Um, you know, looking at, like, what people want as, like, random foils and stuff like that. Oh, I forgot there's a Lord Sander in there. We'll just pull out the, like, regular mythics. Obviously, this is not. But So, 12 packs. 
um, ended up with five mythics, which does not seem very bad for what you're opening. Obviously, there's more slots. Uh, does not appear that made money back, but to be fair, I don't know that I would be trading most of the stuff in anyway, um, except for the commander cards. Um, we did get two commander mythics also. Um, but if you're after and chasing like the oddball stuff, the, the different variations, I think we figured out there's like four or something like that, different variations in the set. You have like regular showcase, full extended. art, extended, gilded foil, gilded foil, borderless. So there's there's more than four, right? Yeah. Um, it also foil? depends. It's only certain Etched, yeah. cards for the gilded foil. Yeah, yeah. What do we figure out? It's only the, it's the ones with the fancy the, border. The house, but it's only like the yeah the, the house, house cards. cards have have the the gilded border and stuff like that. So so it's pretty cool. All in all, I'm not upset. I'm a second out Nix list. My second Titan of Industry. My second. I mean, cluster. the odd Nixilis is like fifty bucks, probably. I, it was like thirty-five this time. Oh, time of really, this, yeah, it dropped, it dropped a lot. Yeah. yeah, but I mean, it's still good. I like need at least two, no matter what. So that's it for this one, and uh, thanks for watching.